Hello everyone, welcome back to Fight Tonight channel. He is in a world of trouble. Gervonta Davies shows off incredible physique ahead of next fight as fans expressed concern for Frank Martin. Gervonta Davies is already in great shape, over two months out from his next fight against Frank Martin. Tank recently confirmed on social media that he would be returning to the ring against Martin on June 22nd in Houston. The fight has not been officially announced at the time of rating. However, Davis is already hard at work preparing for his upcoming clash. Following a grueling session, the Baltimore Banger flown at his ripped physique in a video uploaded to social media on Sunday evening, as the fans expressed their concerns for Martin. Reacting to the video, one supporter wrote, That boy in shape I feel sorry for Frank. Another tweeted, Boy Frank Martin is in a whirl of trouble, two months out and Tank looks like this. A third added, Frank Martin might be going to sleep, I can't lie. Davis has been out of action since his seventh round knockout win over Ryan Garcia in April last year. Shortly after the triumph, he spent 44 days in prison for violating the terms of a sentence which initially saw him avoid jail time. Last May, Davis was sentenced to 90 days of house arrest, 3 years probation and 200 hours of community service over his November 2020 hit and run car crash which injured four people. He was later found guilty of violating the terms of his home detention and as a result was ordered to serve the rest of his 90-day sentence in jail. However, he is now free to move on with his career after having his ankle monitor removed and will box Martin in his first fight back after 14 months. It was initially reported that the boat was being targeted for June 15 as a bar Davies, as signs affirmed that it has been pushed back seven days. As the Toyota Center in Houston, Texas, which is the rumor at venue for the contest, was already booked by American rapper Megan the Stallion on June 15th. Davies confirmed that it was the reason for the slight delay in a tweet posted last week reading I let Meg do her thing week after. The 29-year-old who was officially elevated to become the WBA lightweight world champion in January following Devin Haney's decision to vacate, will defend his strap against Martin on the night. Martin is ranked number second with the major sanctioning body and is undefeated at 18-0. The best win of his fledgling career came against the sarging contender Michael Riviera. The fight put Martin's name on the map at 135 pounds and proved he is ready to step up to world title level. After Jerwan D. Davies threatens boxing commentator, Shakur Stevens and fellow sued by banning him from all his events. A boxing commentator who goes by the social media found himself in hot waters with Jorwande Davis not so long ago. But to make matters worse, Shakur Stevenson has now banned the commentator following suit. Carmel Martin predicts Jorwande Davis' fate. Will Tank roll over the ghost? Champ site caught up with the Salt Lake City born boxer. The reporter asked. Can I get a prediction on our oh, tank vs. Frank? Carmel Maton replied that it would be a great fight. The way he saw it, Martin might be able to take the lead in the initial few rounds. He clarified that the reason he thought so was because the Baltimorean has shown in the past a tendency to sacrifice a few rounds in bouts. Uh, I think it's going to be a great match. Uh, I feel like Frank will probably get to the first few rounds. We know Tank give away rounds a lot, said Maton. However, he added that Tank won't take much time before. Using his vast experience, he will catch up with the Ghost and force his will to win the contest. The Mayweather boxer said, I feel like he'll probably catch him and he used to experience and catch him later on in the fight and take get the dupe. Maton said, thanks for watching guys, if you like this video, please subscribe to my YouTube channel.